Ah, ladies and gentlemen, a uh, very beautiful day here in the uh, great state of Oklahoma, and uh, I thought I'd show something a tad bit different than I normally do, as in uh, model kits and action figures. I uh, like to do custom toys, and uh, when I say custom toy, let me get, get the... Uh, uh, I do like to uh, repaint some things. This is a uh, climbing slide i actually painted that before and i actually i uh, was driving through a neighborhood going home and that was in someone's trash so they actually bought it from me before used it threw it away and i dug it out of the trash and i'm going to repaint it and we're going to sell it again but anyway uh my little paint job held up for uh that's about two years of uh, paint right there being worn off but other that uh is a pretty good job of me painting it so it held up uh another one here let me go i do like to do uh, uh water tables and you can see my dirty laundry i do like my little uh i do like my little cozy coops i actually found that one in the trash too and i did not paint that one uh there's a i have a little bit of a uh uh I want to say a mark that I make if I paint them and if I know that I that I paint them and it's just a little calling sign but anyway that's a little trade secret of mine but uh sandboxes I do have a lot of cozy coops that are ready to be paint and then there's some in there that's just for parts alone uh, uh sometimes you get these without Sometimes you get these without the doors and some missing parts. I don't know why they rip them off, but anyway. And I got to get all the water out. And now, I'd like to do custom, uh, getting in the summertime, we like to do uh, uh, picnic tables. And uh, a few other little things like that. And it's bright out. So, also, since uh, since y'all see me do my uh, little uh, cars, I think we'll, uh, we'll take a venture into... Uh, yes, ladies and gentlemen, I like to show my little dirty laundry. This is the uh, Arc 2, and uh, I did I did label it the Arc 2, and I refer to this as the uh, toy shed. There is a few model kits in here. Uh, some are maybe in totes, but there is some on the. Uh, uh, up here on the uh, well like you might be able to recognize that and uh you know a few others down the up in the rafters but anyway uh lots of uh I mean, lots of uh lots of goodies on here let me see if i can please don't fall i didn't bring my camera stand there we go ah works uh What's the new thing people like to uh, mention? Pickups. Uh, again, I like to spend my money on uh, model kits and action figures. So uh, when they're cheap, I am very, very weak. Except for one thing. And I went to a toy show uh, last week. And uh, I won it because I have some. And that is uh, Evil Knievel. And... When I first saw it, I was like, man, that's too new to like be like an original. It's a uh, re reproduction. I think it came out in 2020. And uh, good shape. It happens the helmet. I don't think they even played with it at all. It's not even scuffed. Uh, I do have original Evil Knievel. And uh, I've always, always said they should have a current uh, Evil Knievel model kit. Uh, 1-8 scale. But that's just that's another topic for another day. As uh, Dan Monroe would say, but uh, I didn't have one. I didn't have a reissue. I got one, but he's kind of seen better days, you know. Hard to find an original one that's in good shape, but anyway, that's good enough for me. But I wanted to add it to the Evil Knievel stuff, which is buried in here somewhere else. Again, uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's hard for me to uh, even begin, uh, you know, to discuss... Uh, what I picked up, of course, there's little things though. Most things I do pick up are female related, you know, Princess Peach, which I wish they made her in her, uh, her uh, gown outfit, not the uh, motorsport. And if you can see behind me, my uh, ever growing 
Classified Joe collection, which is just keeps going. Getting pretty good stacking. And then, of course, I got my two 30-gallon totes full of them, too. But anyway, hopefully, hopefully, I, since we're having decent weather, I can come out here and uh, try to... Uh, I got to do a little organization. I kind of had to... It's about... It's getting to the halfway point in this 20-foot uh, shed of uh, figures on my... Uh, me stacking them down to the ground, working my way up. So hopefully uh, I can pull these out and uh, get them restacked, get, get a little more room in here. I've just been running out of time. But anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's what I got going on today. I uh, like to come out here when it's pretty weather, try to uh, restack, uh, restack everything and uh, play with action figures and uh i like to also i also like to do my uh little uh repaint my cozy coops anyway ladies and gentlemen that's what i got going on today so stay tuned for the next exciting uh episode